team, so today we're going to take a look at our plank. This is what it looks like. This is also what it looks like. So when we break this down in our plank position, what our goal is is to get our wrists under our shoulders and we're tucking our toes, actively pushing out of the toes, shifting the weight forward like we're looking over the ledge of a mountain to create more muscular contractions through our shoulders and our belly. Our belly is tight, so the body is solid and strong as well as protecting the back. A lot of times what we see is that we go from a down dog into a plank. Here we would roll through the spine, and then even if you're dropping to your knees, maintaining that forward shift before we go into our next pose. If you want it to make this more challenging, you can stay onto the toes in the plank, and that'll create more load through your shoulders and belly. And if you want it to make this less challenging, drop to your knees. If this is still pretty challenging, Bring the knees closer to the hands, but still keeping the chest forward of the hands so that we're maintaining that beautiful alignment and the tension where we get the results. And that is your plank position. Mm -hmm.